Hello friends, welcome to engineering tutorial. Uh, in uh, my previous video, we discussed about uh, the representation of sign numbers, especially the negative integers using sign magnitude system. So in this video, we are going to take that discussion forward and we will discuss about the second method of representation of sign numbers which is the 1s complement system. So one thing which is uh, common to the three ways of representing the sign numbers is that the positive integers, the positive numbers, they are represented in the same way in all these three systems. For example, plus 3, let us say plus 3. We also use the same example in the previous video, so we will use the same. Plus 3 in 4 bit representation is 0, 0, 1, 1. So, plus 3 will be represented in this way in sign magnitude. It will also be represented as 0, 0, 1, 1 in 1s complement. And it will also be represented as 0, 0, 1, 1 in 2s complement representation method. The positive integers will be represented in the same way. There will be no change in the representation of the positive integers or the, the positive numbers. Okay? The only thing that changes is the representation of the negative number. Okay? The negative number that is minus 3, the equivalent negative integer minus 3. So, that is what undergoes change. Okay? So, So, the plus 3, it is represented as 0, 0, 1, 1. So, here the negative number will be the 1s complement of the binary representation of the positive number. Okay, so, whatever is the binary representation of the positive number, the equivalent, this, this value, the negative integer, negative number equivalent will be the 1s complement of the positive number representation. So, here minus 3 is the 1s complement of 0, 0, 1, 1. Okay. So, we have discussed in the 1s complement video which uh, we which I posted in my channel that how to calculate the 1s complement of a given binary number. It is simple just invert the bits change every 1 bit to 0 and every 0 bit to 1. So, minus 3 will be 0 will be changed to 1, 1 will be changed to 0. So, it will be 1 1 0 0 okay so minus 3 will be represented as 1 1 0 0 which is the 1s complement of the binary representation of the positive number the positive number is represented as 0 0 1 1 so if we take the 1s complement of 0 0 1 1 it will be 1 1 0 0 so in 1s complement system okay in 1s complement system minus 3 is represented as 1, 1, 0, 0. Positive numbers are represented in the same way. So, 0, 0, 1, 1 will be the representation of plus 3 in sign magnitude and is also represented in the same way in 1s complement. So, the only thing that is different here is the representation of the negative integer. So, here the negative integer minus 3 is the 1s complement of 
the binary representation of the positive number. So, 1 1 0 0. Okay. So, let us uh, uh, take some more examples. Okay. Suppose, we take the number plus 12 and we will represent it using 8 bit format. So, plus 12 will be represented as 0 0 0 0 1 1 0 0 using 8 bit format. Okay. So, this plus 12 now we have to determine the binary representation of minus 12 using 1s complement system. So, minus 12 will simply be the 1s complement of plus 12, the binary representation of plus 12. So, it is simple change every 0 bit to 1 and every 1 bit to 0. So, it will be 1 1 1 1 0 0 1 1 that will be minus 12. The equivalent representation of minus 12 in 1s complement system. Okay. Now, suppose we represent the number plus 25. Okay plus 25. So, it is represented in uh, normal the positive number as 0 0 0 1 1 0 0 1 okay, 16 plus 8 plus 1 okay, this is 1 this is 8 and this is 16 16 plus 8 plus 1 is 25 so plus 25 it is correct. Okay. So, minus 25 will be represented as the 1s complement, okay. the 1s complement of the representation of the positive number. So, change every bit uh, 0 bit to 1 and every 1 bit to 0. Okay. So, minus 25 will be represented in this way just take the 1s complement of the binary representation of plus 25. Okay. Suppose, uh, let us say that uh, we are representing let us say 15, okay, plus 15, the same things just we are in plus 15. So, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0 1, 1, 1, 1. Okay. So, minus 15 will be 1, 1, 1, 1, 0, 0, 0, 0. Okay. Suppose plus 32, plus 32. So, it will be uh, 2 to the power 0, 2 to the power 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, okay. 0, 0. So, minus 32 will be represented as the 1s complement of this 1, 1, 0, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, okay. So, always you have to remember two important things related to representation of sign numbers. First thing, the positive numbers they are always represented in the same way in the three systems, whether it is the sign magnitude or 1s complement or 2s complement, they are represented in the same way. Okay? 0 is the sign bit and the magnitude bits, but it is the negative representation, negative integer representation where the basic concept of the three methods of representation systems that comes into play. In sign magnitude, the magnitude bits they remain the same, only the sign bit changes from 0 to 1. In 1s complement system, 
the negative integer is represented by the one s complement of the binary representation of the positive number. What is the one s complement? Just change every 0 bit to 1 and every 1 bit to 0. So, whenever you come across any question okay, related to sign numbers, the important things that you have to take care of is first determine in what system of representation the given number is represented, whether it is sign magnitude, whether it is 1s complement or 2s complement. Second is to determine the number of bits that are used, whether it is used in 4 bit format or 8 bit format or 16 bit format, whatever be the number of bits that are used. Okay? So, determine the number of bits that are used, only then you proceed to uh, evaluating or solving that question to find the answer. Okay? So, here we have discussed about the 1s complement method of representation of signed binary numbers, so negative integers. In my next video, uh, we will be discussing about the 2s complement method of representing signed numbers. So, I hope you like this video and please subscribe my channel engineering tutorial for more such videos related to electrical electronics instrumentation and communication engineering. Have a great day. Thank you very much.